just looks really good. Great tempo, man. Just keep squeezing your hats. Go to failure, man. Go to failure. <laughs> with rows is guys just turn it into an isometric contraction. So they'll row to here and then they lift their trunk here. They row to here, then they lift their trunk. So there's actually no shortening of the lat. To get the lat short, shoulder extension needs to happen. So all the cues I'm giving you guys are designed to lock you down. So driving your feet through the ground, pushing your hips back, that's gonna create a stable base of support so you have something to row against. Right? People always say, I feel my back when I've got chest support. Of course, because you don't have to stabilize, but we have to mimic that when we don't have it. So, it's elbows back. Think about a chest support here, so you keep yourself locked down. And the whole goal is to get elbows back. So it's not up, it's back. Big arc with the elbow, that's everything. Big arc with the elbow. So it's like almost like elbows are going back and up. Forwards, down and forwards, back and up down and forwards. Yeah. That'll give you a nice view. There it is. Good. That's perfect. Good hard contraction at the top. There it is. Alright, so we're going to finish off with an extended set here. So what he's got here is 50 pounds each side. We're using 25s because what we're going to do is the first set is going to be with a 90 degree trunk angle. Rest for 10 seconds. And he's going to go to failure with a 45 degree trunk angle. Then he's going to rest for 10 seconds, strip, strip the weight. He's going to go to failure again, take 10 seconds rest. He's going to go to 45 degree front angle, and then that'll be it. So four all upsets. You ready, bud? Ready as I can. Let's man. get it. Good. Right to failure here, man. because we just did an unsupported exercise. We don't want to do another unsupported exercise because that's too much neuro drive to stabilize the body parts. If we want to build our back, we have to challenge our back. Does that make sense? So by giving us the chest support, we can now put more neuro drive into the muscles we're actually trying to fatigue and build. So we're going to do 21s here. You guys are familiar with 21s on buys. We're going to do seven at the back because that's where you're weakest, that's the range you're likely not used to going. Then we're gonna do seven full reps and then seven bottom range reps. You guys can listen to the cues because they're very different than what you've probably been told if you wanna build your back. It's how you do it, not what you do. How about that? One more player down there it is. There it is, that's it, it looks really good. Let's go, three more, all the way up. Finish the reps, I'm with you. All the way through, go swing, squeeze, squeeze. That's it. Oh, you're fresh. Oh. Come on. Oh. Wait for it. You got it. Oh. Nice. Wow. That's so good. That was a really good set. Woo. How you feeling, buddy? Quality sets, baby. That's the only thing. Quality sets, oh, quality, not quantity, fellas. Anyone can train long. Training long is just long. <laughs> Hard. So top. Yeah, so. Elbows, elbows facing outwards. Good. Squeeze my fingers. That's it. We're 
traction, get these things moving. Good, finish these guys together. That's it. Elbows right to the ceiling. Drive your chest down. Up, oh, finish it, finish it. Finish it. Finish it. Good. A lot of movement from the scapula here. The scapula is not moving. You don't want to show you. There you go. Yep, that's it. Good. Now you want to get more of a stretch, more of a stretch, 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 more stretch. You got about three more inches to go at the bottom. Go, go. There it is. Just to lengthen it. Right here. Go. One. Just stretch, stretch, more stretch at the bottom. There it is. Feel your last stretch. Okay. Good burn, man. Beautiful. There you go. Well, that's oh. failure. That's all you can do. Perfect. because you're stronger on the negative, right? So if you have no more gas on the negative, that means you've truly hit failure. Four, you just need to stand up. Three, one, two, three, four. Yep, you need to stand up. Three, good job. That's beastly. So not just about repping it, but the negatives, right? Yeah, no, yeah. It's what you need about the standing up now. And you need to get up. Yep, so fight it. It's actually harder with him keeping his legs on my thighs because his muscles have to break, right? If his muscles aren't breaking, he's not using them. Really? So there's more time under tension. That's definitely something new for me. Utilizing the partner's key. I think it'd be easy standing up on someone, but even getting up at all, is you're really getting that nice negative. That's crazy. Yeah, so you're getting the muscles short where it typically doesn't get short. And you're applying the tension through a great range of motion, typically where your muscles just lengthen fast and you lose the tension, you're tearing a lot of stuff. You'll be sore tomorrow. You'll be very sore tomorrow when you accentuate the negative like that. That's how you get big. I know that I got it. I know that I got it. Yeah, yeah. Check, check, check me out. I know that I got it. I know that I got it. 